Fox Books Storytime Saturdays. Today I'm reading to you in front of the Verde River here in Arizona and we're going to read Agent H2O Rides the Water Cycle. This book was written and illustrated by Rita Goldner. Hi, I'm Secret Agent H2O. I've been hanging around for millions of years even before the dinosaurs roamed the earth. My life is crammed with adventure, travel, important assignments, and a few disguises. Join me on a vital mission to hydrate people, animals, and plants. Today I have a great disguise for a secret agent. I'm invisible. The sizzling heat turns me into vapor. You can't see it. I call this sneaky prank evaporation. Let's jump on the water cycle and explore this wild ride. A bunch of other drops evaporated too, so there's lots of vapor up here. It's chilly. Time for condensation from an invisible vapor disguise back to a tiny drop. I join other drops to make some puffy clouds. Wow, what a view! When I find tiny pieces of dust and bacteria in the clouds, I hang on and float around with other little drops. Makes it easier to team up and make bigger drops. Whee! We rain down and call this roller coaster ride precipitation. Hey, let's do it again, but on a different route this time. I evaporate again into my vapor disguise and then detour to a colder place. The drop in temperature changes my shape from vapor into liquid. When the air hits freezing temps, I'm a solid ice crystal. Brr! I almost always change disguises in these three steps. In warm weather, I melt from ice crystal to a drop and then evaporate into vapor. In cool weather, I usually do the three steps backwards. I turn from vapor to a drop and when it gets colder, I freeze. Once in a while, I take a crazy shortcut and skip the middle step. This can only happen when a freezing cold day turns suddenly hot with a dry wind, or when a warm day gets blasted by a super cold wind. During the fast warm ups, I go from ice straight into vapor. This stunt is called sublimation. During the fast cool downs, I do the wacky shortcut backwards. I slip from vapor straight into ice and call this trick deposition. Now where's a cool place for an ice crystal to hang out? Whee! Yippee! Secret Agent H2O conquers the ski slopes. Just don't get flattened by a snowboard. I spy desperate plants and animals in the valley. I'd better melt into liquid. Let's race downhill to the rescue. This plant looks ready to dry up and blow away. Time to squeeze into a root and bring it back to life. Tough work, but it's done. I seep back out in my vapor disguise. From here, it's a cinch to condense into a dewdrop and explore for more rescue work. Yikes, animals get thirsty too. They can't live more than a few days without water. I slip slide down this coyote's throat to give him a cool drink. Whew, glad that job is over. Uh-oh, I sense some trouble ahead on our mission. We'd better investigate. Like all secret agents, I have an evil villain chasing me. His name is Scummy Pollution. Gross, this dirty guy can't get rid of me. After all, I've been around for millions of years. He wants to slow down our mission with this yucky mess. No way. If that happens, people, plants, and animals are all in trouble. Wait, I've got a foolproof escape plan. Follow me. It's an aquifer. Let's dive in. 
We can trickle down through the sand and gravel to ditch scummy. I call this getaway scheme percolation. Now ooze along the underground river. The grains of sand and gravel scrape this grimy guy away. We made it. I'm fresh and clean again. Wonder what we'll find in the river above. Let's seep up and poke around. Surprise, it's the desert river where we started. Thanks for coming along. You're welcome anytime. I'll start a new rescue mission on the water cycle tomorrow. Keep an eye out for me. Agent H2O rides again. I hope you like the story of Agent H2O Rides the Water Cycle. If you'd like to learn more about the author, you can go to ritagoldnerbooks.com. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.